Well guys, welcome to another Triple F Safaris adventure videos. This afternoon we're going to be doing a walk and stalk in the area here right behind me so you see it's nice and open and our target species is going to be a blessed buck. Uh, I'm going to be using the uh, 308 Winchester, uh, my Sauer rifle and uh, we're going to be using a 141 grain uh, Viper bullet. Um, so yeah, uh, I'm happy to take you guys along. Before we uh, get ready to get out there, uh, remember uh, press that uh, like and uh, subscribe button to stay tuned to what we're going to be doing in the future.
Well, the body language confirmed that this was a, a complete miss. Um, how I missed that bless puck, I would not understand. Uh, I might have hit some of the tall grass in front of me um, on the way to the bless puck, and that deflected um, the 308 bullet. Um, but I'm following it up here uh, to confirm that I've missed it uh, and to make sure uh, that I don't leave a wounded animal uh, on, on the felt here. Yeah? Um, but it's confirmed. Uh, he had no eat at all, so let's see, maybe I can get a second shot. Well, as luck would have it, I did get uh, a second shot at the same animal. Um, this time he was about 150 meters away, and uh, my apologies about the uh, focusing here. The, uh, Things happen so quickly, I could not uh, ensure that we are in focus. So on this shot, um, I just shot over the bless box back. Um, yeah, it was just bad positioning and uh, field position on the rifle. Um, and you can clearly hear the bullet impacting the back uh, on a rock. And then you can also see the, the bless box um, does not have any uh, signs of being hit. Um, they moved over to the reach on the, the front of us here, so I'm sneaking up to see if I can't get another shot to them. But uh, to be honest, at this stage I'm starting to wonder if something is wrong with my rifle, um, because I should have had uh, both shots making them count. Um, so yeah, it's, it just goes to show that the longer you hunt, you will get days like today. Plenty of times um, in the video you will hear me huffing and puffing. This is due to the altitude. Uh, we are hunting here at an uh, altitude of 6,800 feet above sea level. In the background you can see some of the mountains of the escarpment dropping down into the Quena Basin. Um, this place buck uh, came in from the ridge that I just showed you before, uh, sat down and observed him for a bit. When hunting blessed buck, um, this is typically what you can expect of a blessed buck uh, male or ram where they will go and stop and have a look at you like this. Um, this gives you a good shot opportunity. Uh, just make sure you know where the vital triangles are. This is a beautiful ram. Um, he's standing at 175 meters away from here. You will notice uh, the blessed buck moving, uh, looking to his uh, right or our left. Um, this is the rest of the herd that's moving in from the left hand side over the ridge. You will see them shortly. Um, so uh, this ram definitely is not the type of animal that we were looking for on this hunt. This uh, will definitely be on my hit list with uh, my, my hunters later in the season. We are back on a GoPro again. I've got a ram coming in just behind the bush here at our 12 o'clock. I'm sitting down now waiting for him to move in.
perfect habit and this is the perfect antelope or blessed buck that we were looking for uh, an old mature male not great uh, trophy size perfect uh, to take for meat so it's got me a bit wondering I need to go and make certain my zero is done again um, but yeah the, the bliss box ram is down um, it didn't go more than uh, about 50 meters so yeah let's walk up to him I'm looking for an old bliss box ram uh, mating season has just started so if we can get some of the old uh, blessed buck rams or males off now uh, we'll get some of the better genes and uh, younger genes back into the bloodline uh, here he is oh this is an old boy uh, he's been fighting here on his run so uh, he's been he's been hammering and uh, yeah beautiful blessed buck they always very beautiful so with the blessed buck, let me show you here. This is how you see an old ram, thick and uh, at the bases. And these ridges are white, 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 but also look how worn off they are here. So this is definitely an old blessed buck. Perfect uh, meat animal. Definitely not a, uh, a trophy animal. So that's perfect. So good shot. Um, put it into the boiler room 308 with uh, 141 grain Viper brass bullets really did the job on it well guys thank you for joining us on the video this is an old old blessed buck ram uh, they're always special to hunt these guys they are really challenging up in this open felt behind me and hills like you've probably seen today so uh, this guy is going to be coming venison looking after needy people so very very glad that we could harvest him so uh, yeah thank you for joining us uh, remember to come and support us on the patreon uh, uh, page and also uh, remember to click on that like and most importantly the subscribe button so you can stay tuned for more videos this hunting season mm -hmm.